Hey everyone and welcome. James Hollings Head was one of the guy who set a realistic expectation of placing top 6 at his Olympia debut this year. But unfortunately, James might have contracted COVID-19 and is isolated currently until he gets all the tests negative. He announced that he will be taking a break from Instagram. That's a real shocker for the bodybuilding world because he prepped for the Olympia for more than one year. James will continue to fight to be the best for the Olympia 2021, but these crucial few weeks of isolation with no training might affect his final look. We all wish him a very speedy recovery. This is what Classic Physique Divian has been waiting for. I just registered for Tampa like a week ago. Sorry for the late announcement. Um, I'm super, super stoked for uh, the show, just to show you guys my new look. Steve Laureus finally returns to the Tampa Pro stage and from there onto the Olympia stage. Steve has definitely one of the best shape in classic physique and if anyone can dethrone Chris Bumstead, Steve's name comes on top. 2018 was the last time when Steve stepped on the Olympia stage and placed 7th. At the Honor Classic 2019, we saw the best of Steve. Although it wasn't good enough to win over George Peterson, but that physique was special. With a long offseason in the books, Steve might step on stage with an entirely different physique. Conditioning is still the key as 2020 wasn't so good for him. When he entered the honored as the favorite to win but didn't even place runner-up. The next generation of bodybuilding has finally arrived. Look at Justin 11 weeks out of the Olympia. That is some serious size with great conditioning this far out of the show. Justin tremendously improved last year and then placed 10th at the Olympia. But this year the lineup seems to be deep. His coach Abdullah pushed sides to the absolute limits post New York Pro. That's why Justin is still in the 290s. Four times men's physique champion Jeremy Bundia is a shadow of his former self and there is minimal chance that we will ever see him get back on the Olympia stage due to multiple injuries. But the champ is trying hard to regain his form but his glory days are past him at this point. Rafael Brandao's game plan has been revealed. 4 weeks into the prep and 16 more weeks to go. That means Rafael will be competing a few weeks post Olympia 2021. At this point, his weight is staying the same, only body composition is changing. Size factor has always held back Rafael from flourishing in the open bodybuilding division. He has one of the most classic shape in the current era. And to anyone who thinks that he should try classic, just remember what happened when Regan Grimes took that route and had to suck down to make weight and ultimately the Olympia placing was disappointing. Hit the thumbs up button if you like the video and smash the subscribe button if you wanna come back for more. Thank you.